Okay, so today I'm gonna show you a really simple warm up. This is what I do before all of my workout routines, and you can do this at home as well. This will warm up all of your muscle groups and get you ready to go so you can have a really successful workout. Do each thing for about 15 to 20 seconds. So we just start with marching with some high knees, get our hips going. Don't worry, we're gonna charge it up from here. All right, then do some bum kicks. This is a dynamic stretch. So what that means is it's stretching your muscles by moving them around instead of by holding static stretches. All right, let's do some high knees. Make sure you really get them up there. Okay, then bum kicks while we're jogging. Really focus on getting your heels right up to your butt cheeks if you can. Keep good posture with your shoulders, chest up. Okay, I'm gonna do half squats. Here's what they look like on the side. All right, we're gonna do some walking lunges. Marty, come. Marty, come. Hello. Where's Monty? Okay, legs are feeling a little bit warm. Let's do our upper bodies. Small circles with your arms. Keep everything in your shoulders and chest nice and tight. Small quick circles. Okay, then widen your circles out. Wider. Get into some backstroke. Get a good twist. Get a full range of motion with your arms. You're warming up your shoulders and your sockets. So if you're gonna do any push-ups or plank motions, gotta make sure you warm up your upper body too. Look, I'm already breathing. Okay, we're gonna go in the other direction. Front crawl. Same thing, get a good twist. Feel the stretch. And then, we're going to narrow down. And down into some tight circles. Shake your arms out. You're a little bit in front. But I always feel like doing dance moves when I do this. So if you do this, and you do this really fast, it's actually warming up your chest muscles. And you can do it down low, and up high. All right, give your arms a shake, front and back. All right, we'll do our neck just for a second. Just gonna do ear to shoulder, side to side. Just waking up our range of motion. And then looking side to side.
And now chin to chest and chin to the sky. All right, now we're gonna do our torso. So we're gonna start with um, upper torso circles. So try to keep your lower torso relatively still and you can round your back, open up your shoulders, round your back. Feels like a massage. Other direction. All right, now we're gonna do hip circles. So keep your upper body relatively still and do some very sexy hip circles. I always like to do them like this, and my teammates make fun of me. Other direction. Again, we're just working on range of motion here, getting everything moving. All right, we still need a little bit more on our legs here. Hamstrings need to get a little bit more of a warm up, so we're gonna do some toy soldiers. I'm just gonna walk and kick out. You don't have to touch your toe, but flex your foot and reach forward with a straight leg. Reach forward with your straight arm. You should use your abs to pick up your leg each time. Okay, we're gonna do some one-legged deadlifts. You're gonna stand on one leg, you're gonna reach with the opposite hand. A lot of people try to do it with the same hand, same foot. Don't do that. Just testing your balance, warming up your ankles and feet, and stretching your hamstrings. If you're having trouble balancing, pull in right here. Whoop. String going, switch legs. Right, everything feels pretty warm. Now I'm gonna do some full squats to just finally get my legs all the way warmed up. You're all warmed up and you're ready to go and do whatever workout you've got coming to you. Have fun.